What's up with it, no weather, man? <clears throat> hey, Fat Trill label mate MGE Jizzle just dissed him in the interview. You know what I'm saying? Which is crazy. A lot of people <laughs> might have thought they was fucking with each other, or they was locked in, that was his man. But what you gotta understand is just cause people on the same label don't necessarily mean they really share that same love for each other or it's it's more than business, you know what I'm saying? Or it's deeper than rap. That's not always the case. You know, some people that could be on the same label, it could just be business, you know what I'm saying? And you ain't you don't really gotta know them, but it's just business. You know what I mean? As, as you know, like a lot of people that was, you know, in groups or on the same label, they ain't really fuck with each other behind the scenes. So you never know. But I did think he fuck. I thought they fucked with each other a little harder, cause you know they was um they was always together. Like you see, a lot of times I seen Fat Trail, I seen him. You know what I'm saying? In the background with him <clears throat> or around him. So I thought they was really fucking with each other. And they just dropped some music together, like not too long ago. They just had. Dropped a couple songs together in the lab. And one of the videos, I was actually forgot what that. I think that joint, No Harm. Yeah, this joint, we'll put it in here. No Harm. That joint, Jack Crank. The video, the song they had together, that shit was cranking. So I thought they was really locked in. This shit just, just I guess, just, 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 I ain't gonna lie, kind of blew my mind. I was like, damn. You know what I'm saying? So he went on Ant Platform and he was talking about, you know, Basically, the issue with him and Gino and, you know, him being Bob from over there. But at the same time, he he, he kind of threw, threw a couple jabs at Trill, too, saying that Squirrely and Trill was more so how that relationship came about. He don't really got nothing to do with how Squirrely handled the business. Because if you don't know, MGE, I'm, I'm what I'm starting to realize is MGE. I think Bam started the MGE joint, him and Squirrely, you know what I'm saying? Free Bam. Actually, uh, had a run-in with Bang, but I ain't even gonna speak about it on here, but, you know, he, we got mutual people, um, but I guess Bam and Squirrely and them started that MGE shit, you know what I'm saying, and then they signed Trill, because before M Trill was with MGE, he was just SBSB, Slutty Boy, and, and, and some other shit, so, I don't know, I guess they started the label, they signed Trill, and Jizzle and Trill wasn't really close, that's what he signed in the interview, man, but. Yeah, that shit got crazy. So I don't know what this mean for MGE. Is they gonna keep making music together? What that mean for Cash? I don't know Cat Cat like that. I think Cat one of the hottest youngest, new one of the new niggas. Like he one of my favorite youngest. He don't really get that much push or that promo, but he definitely Cat one of the ones, man. Sorry, I hope Shardy stay out of trouble and really keep his head uh his head down and do what he gotta do because he definitely he fire. Like, I fuck with Shorty. Like, the cab music is like that. He need definitely get more attention. But, um, yeah, I don't know what this means for MGE, man. I don't know if they fucking with each other. Uh, you know, it gotta be, you know, Squirrely. I wanna have Squirrely feeling because he fuck with Trill. That's his artist. And then, you know, his man Jizzle, you know, shading him and some shit going on. They ain't fucking with each other. I don't know, man. So I guess they cleared up whatever mishaps they had, which is always a good thing. If, if 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 two men could come together and talk, especially out here, man, if you if you could come together and talk about or or get an understanding on your misunderstanding, that's always always great. You know what I'm saying? As men, as black men, if you could talk whatever your issue you got out, man, that's always best, man. I rather, I'd rather brothers be able to talk it out, you know what I'm saying? People was confused because him and Ant went back and forth at it on live and he was saying he was gonna do this and then the Ant. So they don't know if he was riding for MGE or he was riding for Trill. You know what I'm saying? Either way, it looked like them brothers, I guess, came to some type of resolution and some understanding and they was able to do the interview. Um, so like I said, I don't know what this means for MGE. We, we just got to stay tuned, see what the fuck happens, and it is what it is, no weapon. Step in this bitch and I'm ready to work. No welling, yeah, that shit on my shirt.